what's up guys welcome back once again it is me Malt so happy to be here with you guys today I actually went to a color run this morning if you don't know what that is you can google it but uh, you run around and you just you get color thrown on you but I was actually volunteering uh, for Young Life so that's what I was doing this morning I already took a shower got all the color off of me my face uh, was a little bit covered and everything if you guys have ever done a, a run of some sort of that, anything like that let me know down below that'd be cool to to hear about like a Spartan race or anything like that but guys we are still moving up with the Town Hall 9 we have so much to do in every video now uh, the only problem is that two of our builders have been held up on the um, on the expos those are gonna be done in two hours which is freaking awesome so I can't wait for those to be done because then we're gonna be able to upgrade the wizard tower right now so the wizards level two guys the wizard is level two I did that yesterday the archers already level six holy crap Nice, the archer tower went up real quick, but that's because the first like four levels only took like a day total. Um, we are able to research stuff right now, guys, but I don't have enough elixir or anything to do that. So what I need from you all to do down below is comment what you want me to research next, all right? So um, I'm thinking that maybe loons because I'm going to start using loonian again, um, or maybe archers. Uh, probably one of those maybe even giants because giants are freaking beasts but we could get max loons guys 54 more damage and 155 more hit points that is a lot that is so good so we have that to look forward to uh, we can also come in here and go look at our defenses so we can build a Tesla guys so we're gonna do that right now we're gonna build this Tesla get this bad boy out here boom there we go town on nine we have now got another Tesla what sucks is that normally I would put it right here next where the air sweeper is but we have the air sweeper now so we got to figure out something else to do so once that Tesla is done guys in uh, a day nice so that's gonna be done in a day then we are going to do a base build because the expos are gonna be done as you guys can see and uh, then we're just gonna be able to research stuff and we don't have anything else to buy right now we have nothing else more to buy there um, army is all good and uh, what's next resources we could build those but that's pretty much it. We don't have anything else to do. So that's freaking awesome. Now all we have to do is level up everything that we already have and all the new stuff. Uh, these walls are currently level 6, guys, which is awesome because, um, I don't know, that's, that's a good level. I still see a lot of people that don't even have walls that level. I love spinning gold on walls. I love it, but I hate it because I think that these walls look so freaking sick. And level 9 walls look even better. So I can't wait to have an all like matte black Town Hall 9. Guys, let me know what your favorite maxed out Town Hall is because I think that Town Hall 9s look pretty freaking sick. Like, you know, like a matte black car or something like that. So they look pretty cool. Now I'm just talking a lot and you guys haven't seen a single raid yet. So let's go ahead and jump into uh, some of these attacks that I've had recently. We've been getting a lot of loot. So I'm going to go ahead and show those to you, all right? So here's the first one, guys, against Lai, the chat FC. Uh, he had a dead Town Hall 9. Now the only thing about dead Town Hall 9s is that it just, just means the Expos are empty. That's all there is to it. Um, so he still has really, really high level mortars and uh, cannons and archers and everything. But we're barching around the base and you can see that the majority of all of his loot is in the mines and the pumps, which are thankfully um, only within one level of wall. Or behind one layer of wall all the way around. So super stoked about that. You can see the archers are working their way in. Taking out all these cannons. There's so many. There, he just had cannons alongside. I'm going to drop that uh, heal spell right there. Because I knew my king would run into it. And I wanted to make sure that he stayed up. As well as the queen since she's only level 1. So she's going to come up in here. She's going to take out that enemy wizard. And uh, I was trying to get the 50% on that. Wasn't trying to mess with that Tesla up there. And we've already gotten 238,000 gold. As well as 202 thousand elixir now uh, the queen's gonna do her job over here in just a second and these barbarians thankfully are gonna head right here and get a whole bunch of gold for me uh, from that from that mine right there and then I believe the queen's gonna get another 4,000 or so from this so we're gonna break that 300,000 gold woo and 204,000 elixir we've already got that 51% only 11 seconds left the queen's getting hit I'm just gonna go ahead and save her life here for a little bit 308,000 gold, guys. 204,000 elixir. Only 84,000 um, dark elixir because we weren't able to get into that or this one um, to get that dark elixir. But I'm okay with that. Let's go ahead and jump on to the next one, yeah? All right, so we're facing it's Mr. Fister. 
<laughs> what a ridiculous name. And you can see that his base is so freaking rushed, guys. I saw this and I was like, if only I was on my Town Hall 10 and I could rush, could crush this base. But we weren't able to. Uh, we're just coming in with our Barch again, coming in from the top, from the bottom, from the sides, trying to get around to all of the different mines and pumps on this base. We've already gotten 139,000 gold, which is epic. Coming in with over 70,000 elixir. And uh, we've got these archers up at the top. I wanted to get them in there so that they could get that gold mine for me. That wizard's taking like three shots to take out any of the archers. We got all that. Now all that's left is right up here. And um, I do believe that the archers take out the cannon. Yep. So the archers take out that cannon up there. And then we can go ahead and fast forward and y'all can see what happens right here. So we're going to drop off this other archer. I'm going to go ahead and drop off the queen. She's just going to snag that dark elixir for me. Then she's going to start shooting the wall. But I knew she was going to, so I'm perfectly fine with it. And then she's going to head in and be out of range of anything in there and take out that last little bit of elixir for us. I'm going to save her life and we get a good amount of loot, guys. But now it's time for a live raid for y'all. So we've got a million gold right now, which is really good. We just got to keep on saving up. We can upgrade our wizard tower with that. We can upgrade our archer tower with that. We can upgrade our uh, air defense with that. How <clears throat> our air defense with that, which is going to take a day as well. Once these expos are done, we'll be able to upgrade the other ones. I can't wait to get expos. It's going to be so sweet. I haven't had expos. Uh, well, I mean, I have them on my main account, but I haven't had like low level expos in a while. So let's go ahead and attack, and I'll be back with you guys in just a couple seconds. Check out this. Mr. Lunatic, you're a lunatic for abandoning your base. Coming in. All right, so we're just going to go ahead and start as usual. You guys know how to barge. You drop off your barbarians. You drop off your archers behind them. Get them up in there at uh, next to whatever you need. And we'll go ahead and see how much of this loot we can get. I imagine we're going to be able to get almost 100% of it because it looks like it is all in the mines and the pumps. I wish I had a couple more archers trained up. Uh, that was one mistake that I definitely had there was not training up enough archers. Go ahead and see if we can get some barbarians up in there. That side should be good. If we can get some barbarians inside this wall right here, that'll help us out a bunch. Uh, come on, get in there. Get in the wall. What are you doing taking so long? Just get in the wall. There they go. All right, so they're heading into the wall. Taking that out. Come on, take all the gold. Take all the gold. What did I just tell you guys? All right, so we're actually going to drop our queen off right here. She's going to get shot a couple times and then take that out. We'll go ahead and drop off our king. And we'll let him head up in here, get the rest of this gold. There goes all of that, and zero, zero, zero. Okay, yes, please, guys. 221, 187,107. Did somebody steal some? Oh, guys, some, oh, yeah, I got wrecked recently. Where was it? That one down at the bottom. Someone stole a lot of my loot. They took a lot of my dark elixir. Uh, and then somebody came at me with witches and took a bunch of my loot as well the other day. So, I lost a, an okay amount of my Dark Elixir, but once we get 24,000, guys, we will be able to upgrade the Queen to level two. So if you're stoked about that, let me know. Woo! But that's gonna be it, guys. We also have a little bit of money in here, 197 of each from um, our victory recently. I'm just gonna keep that in there so that it doesn't get uh, stolen from Everything else, even though it can get stolen still. But blah, 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 I digress. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I really, really do appreciate it. As always, make sure you keep calm and you clash on for me. Again, comment down below what troop you want me to upgrade next. All right, see you guys in the next episode. Peace.